Whenever you're watching this video, it is currently 9.58 a.m. I woke up at 9.15. Basically, long story short, I had to pick up my mom at the airport last night. So I didn't leave my house to pick her up until midnight. And then I got home at like 2 a.m. and went to bed. So I have not had much sleep. I'm very tired, but I have to go get labs done for a prescription refill. That's where I'm headed right now. I just got here. So I just checked in on my phone and I'm about to go run inside and do the labs. So that's where I'm going to go right now. Maybe I'll try and get a clip of my phone or something we're gonna go in and then we'll get this whole thing started so let's go get our labs done i just ate some fruit snacks because i don't have to fast let's go take some blood you needed a face mask and i don't have one in my bag so i'm walking back to my car to grab a face mask because i should have some in here got one let's go back in i got the blood it was really easy here's my little gauze covering that I'm just gonna leave it on for like 10 more minutes but I'm running into duck donuts because there's one right here and they are literally so good if you've ever had them so I'm gonna go run in there and grab a couple donuts for me my mom maybe my brother yeah let's go in these literally look so good before she put it in she showed me them and the box is warm I'm literally so excited to eat them but I'm gonna take off my little thing real quick I don't think it's bleeding anymore. No, I don't think it is. It's like the tiniest little dot ever. Oh. How is it? Mm, it's yummy. So yummy. It's warm. Mm -hmm. It is a bit later. I made my post on Instagram and I'm gonna head down to the pool because lay out for a little bit and swim and stuff and get some sun. Later today, we're going over to Molly's to watch The Bachelor and then sunset later tonight. I literally have the biggest bruise on my leg. I don't know if you can even see it because I got it literally last night and it's already like bruising over. So that's fun. Let's go pick out a bikini and go to the pool. I think I'm gonna film a little TikTok, get ready with me for the pool day. Yeah, let's go do it. Okay, so I picked out this bikini from RL. It's one of their terry cloth ones. So here's the bikini. I'm gonna apply sunscreen before I go. I've actually been using lotion sunscreen and applying it before I leave. I think it like works a little bit better than the spray sometimes. And I already put on face SPF. I used the caught face SPF. I'm filming a TikTok. Okay, hair is up. I just threw some shorts on, grabbed my water, I'm gonna go fill it up, and then we will leave. I don't even know what time it is. 1.25. <laughs> it has been a few hours later it's almost 4 p.m now and i just did my makeup pretty lightly but i also just ate but i'm about to leave in a second here i grabbed a bikini i kind of just picked a random one this is from kulani's yeah that's kind of the deal um i'm gonna throw on some comfy clothes to go watch the bachelor at molly's and take you guys along i'm just wearing this rl brown so that's what i'm gonna wear and bring my extra battery and i'm gonna bring my charger too because you never know i think my camera battery is gonna die eventually so hey bentley so she must have taken it back she took meatball back why <laughs> meatball <laughs> i'm so but I'm yeah their their conversation was finished like mid conversation last yeah. time what are you doing, Bentley? She said, being bad. No, stop chewing the pillow. Oh, I knocked my nail off. Oh. <laughs> I hope you 
you didn't swallow that. Oh, well, we're gonna lose it. Oh, it's right here. <laughs> I gave you your toy to chew with Brooke because you always are mean to her. <laughs> and you took it over there. Don't do that. This is what he's got brewing. That was me, Paul. She couldn't spell me. <laughs> Date is awful. Reese is with us. It's gonna come a little. We might get some pink clouds. So I'm about to hop in the shower and do my shower routine and then do my skincare. So I'm so excited to be partnering with Bubble on today's video. If you guys don't know Bubble or haven't heard of them, you are missing out because they are one of my literal favorite skincare brands. I have put so many of my friends onto Bubble because I like trust them as a brand so much and I think their products work amazing and have worked wonders on my skin personally. Yeah, I'm so, so excited to be partnering with Bubble on today's video to show you guys my products in my skincare routine because seriously I have so many products in my routine from bubble and I love them all so much so I'm gonna show you guys like my full routine I wash my face when I'm in the shower so this is bubbles cleanser the fresh start gel cleanser I love it it's super lightweight and super gentle which is something I look for I don't like products that are gonna irritate my skin so first things first I'm gonna hop in the shower we're going to take off my makeup with the bubble makeup remover and I'll show you guys all that once I get out let's go take a shower and get clean because I feel sandy and just don't like feeling sandy so so I just got out of the shower I washed my face using the fresh start gel cleanser and now I'm gonna go in with my serums and creams to be honest I don't do a super lengthy skincare routine just because I like to keep it more minimal that the products work I guess is the best way for me to describe it so this is my little skincare setup that I have going on you can see I have a lot of bubble products and then I have like my tanners and eye creams and stuff for like my main skincare products so I always use the cleanser and then I use this face mask about once a week I have been seriously really liking the deep dive face mask I think it works amazing it has really amazing ingredients exfoliating which is something you don't want to use every single day so I try to use this every Sunday it is currently on Wednesday so I'm not gonna be using this tonight hold on I'm gonna change real quick and then we can get into my skincare routine okay I'm gonna clip back my hair real quick I just changed out of my towel when I'm doing my skincare I try to space it out so it's not like me just layering all the products at once and more so me giving the products time to soak in so that's just kind of what I'm gonna do I'll show you guys step by step as I'm doing them it's currently 10 p.m. so I'm gonna start with the first step I have been using the bubble daydream serum for about two-ish months I've been using it since it originally dropped guys when I tell you I've been in love with this I actually just opened this new bottle like two or three days ago. I have my old one in the trash that's empty. Used it all the way up. There was nothing left to pump out of that thing. I have been in love with this. I've used other niacinamides on the market and I have seen such amazing results with this one. I think it's the vitamin C that's in this that also gives it that extra kind of boost that you're needing. I just use one drop. I use this every morning and every evening and it's just like a serum consistency and I just let this soak into my skin just to give it the full benefit. One thing I love about Bubble is that all of their products are so affordable and they're sold in stores like Walmart, which just makes it 10 times better because you're getting an amazing quality skincare product at an affordable price, which is just what everyone needs. From like the bottom of my heart, cannot say enough positive things about Bubble because I'm seriously so in love with the brand. So I'm gonna let this soak into my skin for a minute and then I'm gonna go in with my oil, which I don't use every single night. I do use this after I use the the AHA PHA mask from them. They just work really well together. I use this if I'm needing a little bit of extra moisture. So I've just been using this when I feel like I need it. Now that the daydream serum has soaked in, I'm just gonna apply this. This and the daydream serum dropped around the same time period and I've been loving both of them. This one, you only need a couple drops. So normally I do three drops. I do one on my forehead and then one on each cheek. 
this applicator i don't know why so satisfying you twist it and it locks in and then you untwist it and when you twist it and lock it in it refills pump thing i'm gonna let this soak in for a while and then i will come back to you guys later those are the only two serums i use at night i'm gonna go make some food because i am kind of hungry so maybe i'll make some top ramen or something i just made top ramen i'm gonna just watch some one tree hill for a little bit and then i'll probably head to bed soon because i'm tired Schedule navigation. It is almost 11.30 now, so it has been a while. I applied my retinol, so now I'm just finishing off my skincare routine. I use the Slam Dunk Hydrating Moisturizer. I actually just replaced this one as well. Yeah, I love this. I also love their other moisturizer. It's more like a water-based, but right now I'm using the more like lotion-y formula. I honestly love them both. I've used both. It isn't too thick, but it does give you the perfect moisture layer to your skin but yeah i just finished my skincare so everything is done sometimes i'll mix in like tanning drops or something in with my moisturizer it works perfectly fine that is my skincare routine with bubble if you guys want to check out bubble please 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 go see the link in my description box or go to your local walmart definitely go check out bubble thank you so much to bubble for partnering with me on this portion of the video and i'm going to close off the video here because i'm about to go to bed i am so tired so thank you guys so much for watching today's vlog I hope you enjoyed it and I will see you guys in the next one. Bye guys.